Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for this video, I'm going to be doing a get ready with me, just talking about different things while I do my makeup and my hair. And then I'm going to be showing you guys fall outfits from Fashion Nova. So if you guys are interested in all of that, just keep on watching. Eat well, exercise, and then use aromatherapy. And it says, our sense of smell is direct connected with the emotional part of the brain use essential oils to help calm the nervous system and a busy mind so as someone who struggles with anxiety I need to do everything I can to calm my nervous system which is why I do yoga twice a day just follow YouTube videos I do a meditation and obviously like doing some physical activity so I am thinking of buying some essential oils from Amazon that I saw and I want to try them out also and update you guys on if it helps me relax and stuff. And actually that reminds me, I hadn't talked to you guys about Frenchie. So this is a magnesium stick. It's a soothing body serum stick. So it's infused with magnesium and squalene, which I'm not sure what that is. But basically, it helps to relax you and just soothe you. So I really like to do it on my neck, especially like around my shoulders. Because when I'm stressed or feeling anxious, my neck and shoulder areas start to feel tight. And even just the smell of this is very comforting. And yeah, really the owner of this brand is Ashley Tisdale which we know as Sharpay from High School Musical and Maddie from The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. I had actually seen some people go on a brown trip with that brand and I had already heard about that brand before so I was like, wait, let me look more into it. And then turns out, don't quote me, I'm just saying what I remember, but I think she started it off as a blog or that is what Frenchie is. Like it's a blog where she posts stuff about like wellness and stuff and so then she decided to make these products because she herself deals with anxiety and like panic attacks and all of that so she wanted to create some products hmm. should I put some on my forehead? just put it a little bit so she wanted to create some products to like help soothe you and relax you because that's very important for your nervous system to stay regulated and I thought that was just so amazing because I'm like, girl, me too. I am also deal with a lot of anxiety. And if I could like buy a product like this that stands for like mental health and all of that. And also was made by someone who struggles with anxiety. Like, I'll believe in it even more, you know. I'll believe in the usefulness of this. So yeah, and then I also now have a hand cream and I just want to continue to get more products from that line just because that's something that I believe in and that I'd want to support. But honestly, I think it has helped. That's why I do want to try That's why I do want to try the um aromatherapy essential oils just because if like this little stick that smells really comforting has helped me feel more calm and at ease, especially at night just to like wind down then I'm sure the essential oils will too. But I will definitely keep you guys updated on that. But yeah, just really make time for yourself and to take care of yourself because I know that with these upcoming months or with the holidays, things can get a little bit sad for some people or, or with the time change and stuff, you may not feel as motivated or happy. So honestly, just doing the little things does add up and make big differences in the end is moving on to my next topic again if you guys have not watched love island games you guys need to go watch first watch season two of love island on netflix and if you like it and the cast go on to watching love island games on peacock because it's literally my favorite show right now and I only have like one or two episodes left which is sad because I always look forward to a new episode every day and now I'm gonna have to find a new show to look forward to so if you guys have any suggestions of like any good shows please let me know because I would love 
to get hooked on a new show to look forward to because honestly sometimes we can get stuck in living like in a just a routine and you need to find those little things that like make you happy and look forward to things so that's what love island games has been for me and i don't know that that show keeps me on my toes though like the tea is teeing the tea is teeing on that show it's crazy i love it though like for sure that's my favorite reality tv show right now i'm like halfway on episode 18 and the fact that they send like one of their good friends home is crazy i don't know if only if you've watched um love island games or love island you'd get it but i don't know i was shocked but at the end of the day you know they're all even though even if they're friends and all like they're gonna have to end up competing against one another for those like i think it's like 100k that they get and that show has literally made me cry made me laugh every emotion like i was just so invested in it and yeah you guys should definitely watch if you guys are bored or looking for a show to get into love island usa season 2 and love island games you guys should definitely go watch that okay and i just want to share with you guys the lipstick that i always always use this is the one i'm wearing like 80 percent of the time it is by maybelline it's the super c and it's in the shade 75 fighter I love it because it's like this brown shade but with like a red undertone it's just perfect i think it's perfect for fall and honestly year round because i wear it all the time <coughs> but this one will stay on for a very long time it usually does not come off unless you're eating something like really greasy or with a lot of oil you know but other than that it stays on for a very long time so i will always always continue to wear this and i hope they never discontinue it okay so i'm gonna add these little jewels on the side of my eyeliner just because i love the little like pop they give and it just makes the whole makeup look a little bit more cute and girly so i'm gonna go ahead and put two dots of my of my eyelash glue and then just wait for it to dry for a little bit and then I will go ahead and stick on the little gem I know this was more in during the time that like euphoria came out and all of that but it's just so cute and I could see myself doing it year-round but anyways I think the new season of euphoria is actually gonna come out next year which I'm excited for because honestly that's a show that i liked it was really interesting even though it was very very graphic you know um i still really enjoyed watching it and i also like um dived into like the meaning behind it or why it was made and basically the director just made it about like um some of the things that he went through and then also just kind of to show and spread some awareness about like the reality of like drug abuse and all of that. Um, don't quote me on that though. I had seen these interviews like two years ago probably so I may be saying it wrong or something. But I think that's what I remember. And because I know it was very controversial. Because I know it was very controversial about like letting teens watch it or not because that may actually make them want to try drugs even more or something but i don't know anyways now i'm gonna curl my hair this is like second or third day hair so i am gonna wash it tonight and i'm gonna also do a mask on it probably but i am going to curl it with this remington wand this is the one that i've been using for years they like re what is it called i don't know but they basically made it look different like they revamped it or like they i don't know they just updated the look but it's been the same one and i freaking love it for curls and i have never liked any other curling iron so i think i will always ride and die for this one but anyways yeah so since my hair is already a little bit wavy and curled 
I'm not gonna curl it how I'm not gonna curl it how I usually do because usually I do three parts. I know someone asked me in one of the videos to do like a a curling hair tutorial, which maybe I could do, but for now, um I'm just gonna grab pieces and curl it. Usually though I do part it so I do like three parts the bottom, the middle, and then the top. And I do about like two, three, or four curls per layer, but today we're just gonna recurl them. And I usually leave it on for like 15 seconds and then I just let it go. But anyways, I'll be back with some done curling it so that we can get into the Fashion Nova haul. This matcha is so freaking good. I love it, I love it, I love it. Did I mention that one of the benefits is that it could help with depression? So I'm gonna be drinking this every single morning. Okay, anyways, I'm talking to you guys from this angle because I want you guys to see the full fit. Not this fit, but the outfits that I'm gonna try on. And Thanksgiving is in a few days, so I am going to show you guys my Thanksgiving outfit first. And as a reminder, all of these items are from Fashion Nova, and this is not a sponsored video, but they do send me free clothes. So I am going to try on the Ren sweater mini dress set, any size small. I figured this would be stretchy, I'm usually a medium, but uh, I figured it'd be stretchy, so I went with the small, so let me try it on now. Okay, so here is the dress in a size small. It definitely stretches, so size down, maybe one or two sizes down. But I absolutely love this because look, it's like a knitted dress and then you have your little sweater thing up here. So you could take this off and wear it with a different outfit, but it's just so cute and I love the material. It's that cozy knitted material, perfect for like Thanksgiving vibes, you know, or just this cold weather. So this is perfect for this season. And then the little sleeves also, they're super cute. I love this one. On to the next one. The name of this one is the Allison Sweater Maxi Dress in a size small. I decided to get in a size small just because I wanted it to be really tight fitting. And I'm really glad I went with that size so you guys could also size down and you guys should be fine. Okay, so this is another dress with a similar style here at the top. However, this one is not detachable. It is attached to it, but... I am obsessed with the little slit right here. It's so cute. It's like fancy but casual at the same time. So you could definitely dress it up. I literally love this slit. It's like perfect right here. Okay, so now we have the Lana sweater pants set. And let me check if I got it in a small or a medium. I got it in a size medium. It kind of looks like a one piece, but it's actually its own little zip up. Um, sweater it's knitted material also super comfy and cozy then it comes with the sweatpants that have this little fold over detailing just giving it more of that like 2000s vibe and the sweatpants are also knitted and I am five feet so everything drags on me there's hardly <laughs> any pads that I don't have to get tailored so these are a little bit longer but when I wear them with my Uggs, it's perfect, so definitely if you're more on like the petite side, short side, I think it would still be a good fit for you. Okay, so next we have the Solo... Okay, so next we have the Solo Mission Sleeky... Okay, so next we have the Solo Mission Slinky Jumpsuit in a size medium. So it is a jumpsuit. Again, it fits me long, but that's because I am really short. This is like perfect when you want to show a little bit of skin, but not too much. Also, I would just wear pasties with this, and I absolutely love it. It is that like almost, no, I wouldn't say it's a spandex material. It's just like the slinky type of material. So yeah, I really like it, and I think this is like perfect for like New Year's or something like that. But I feel like you could also dress it down, so it's definitely those type that you can dress up, dress down. But yeah, I got a size medium, and it fits perfectly. Okay, so next we have this Evelyn corset in a size medium. 
it honestly fits perfectly it has like the little spaghetti strap and then this is detachable and it's just mesh material so definitely don't wear on a cold night out but i feel like it would be a good top maybe for like the club or you know somewhere where you also need room to breathe i think this is perfect and then the skirt is called chasing the night pu leather skirt in black and it is also a size medium and honestly it fits really good i was skeptical at first because it does not have a zipper so it just has like this like resorte type of material right here like the stretchy um type of material but it honestly fit really good like it still looks tight even though like there's no zipper with it so yeah this is definitely a cute outfit it's still giving like fall but like hot girl fall vibes so yeah these are the other two pieces that i got now i also got some leather pants one of my shirts didn't come in so i'm gonna order it again but i am going to try on some leather pants and keep this top on okay so these are the julia faux leather trouser pant in a size small because last time i got some leather pants in a size medium and they were just too big on me so i just decided to go with so i just decided to go with the small so that hopefully these are tight fitting and they are they're like perfect though because there's still some stretch to them around the waist so i could definitely breathe but here are the pants so they don't really have pockets they have like the illusion of pockets and actually they are pockets but they just have like this little thing sewed on here and that's just the style of it but i don't mind i still think they're super cute and again they're a little bit longer but if i wear these with heels i think i should be good but again i am five feet so everything's gonna fit kind of longer on me but honestly i'm glad i went with the size small because i feel like they do fit perfectly and i can breathe in them and they still make but they still make me look snatched and they are also high-waisted which is basically all i wear so yeah these are really cute leather pants and they don't have that weird smell to them that a lot of like faux leather things do so that's a plus okay and last i got this puffy jacket it is called looking brand new cropped puffer jacket in a size medium and this is definitely giving like i'm going to the snow but i still want to look chic and cute so let me put it on so i like that there's like a button here but you can also button it to put your hands in there to get warmed up and honestly i think i could have gone with the size small a little big on me but either way this is gonna keep me cozy and i believe they have it in different colors so, so if you guys are looking for like these puffy type of jackets you should definitely check out fashion nova because i have a lot of them on there and while we're here i just wanted to show you guys this coat from ranchito boutique so this one's not from fashion nova but it is definitely giving fall as well i feel like it's definitely matching the vibes of this outfit the colors are matching so yeah, this coat is available on Ranchica Boutique. This is in a size medium and it fits perfectly. It's warm, but not like those jackets that are like too big and thick. Like you could still wear this indoors because it's not too thick to the point where you're going to be sweating if you wear it indoors. So this is perfect for like Thanksgiving as well. Okay, so I am done with this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I will be posting more and there will be giveaways. So stay tuned for that. Thank you all so much for watching and I love you guys.